that's where I'm gonna poop in my pants. <laughs> Um, no, but uh, we're a little bit early, but this is the place where we're gonna go ahead and go for the zombie apocalypse light As you can see, it's really early, so it gives us a couple of hours to go check out Austin And uh, we'll be back We'll be back to put down some zombies AK walkers AK skin eaters Biters Are ready to kill some zombies? <laughs> Still stuck on her phone. Man, technology, I swear. It's taking away all the fun. Big boy. Tiny burgers. So if we focus a little bit, we see that there's already a line forming. Oh, we close the door. <laughs> Check this out. <laughs> now, Kali, get off from there. Oh, I'm sorry. It's because you're wearing kind of like the same color. That must be it. But I don't look alike or anything. <laughs> you guys know the one right from the vlog, right? Yeah. What vlog is that? I'd like to check it out. Oh, it's for all my... Whoa, that was way too close. Alright guys, so we couldn't record inside because it was really dark and there was no cameras allowed. But it was really cool. We had lots of fun. You know, I kind of felt like Rick Grimes in there. I don't know, the Latino version. <laughs> Anyways, I really do recommend it uh, for y'all to come check it out whenever it's in your city. And uh, so yeah, uh, see you back at home. Hut hamburgers, where you can wear your hats under the hut. <laughs> So we decided to make an extra stop before actually going to San Antonio and we came to the graffiti park. Alright guys, so fortunately it's really dark, but it's really cool. So if you're ever in Austin, I recommend you that you come over here to the graffiti park and check it out. Um, one of y'all guys uh, told me to check it out on uh, Facebook, so I did. I just wish it would have been uh, daytime so you could have seen this. <laughs> but yeah, it's a little bit hard to get up here. Uh, so I'm uh, pretty sure more than uh, 10 people have fallen, but uh, we made it up here. Hope I didn't scare you. Unfortunately, because it was dark and because it was against the rose, I wasn't able to record inside the haunted house. But uh, it's it was really cool. I definitely recommend it. That if they're in your town and you have the opportunity to go, uh, check it out because it's something different. You know, they actually give you the guns and you get to shoot at the zombies. 
there was this one well there was actually like three rooms that really caught my attention there was this one where there's all these tvs and they have that um let me see if I can fix the camera really quick. Oh, there you go. Um, they had like those great uh, TVs, you know, whenever there's no channel or whatever, and they were all tagged up. And it was just a, a really uh, creepy room with all these TVs with no signal. Um, also, guys, another thing is that if you have a chance, check out my interview for um, myessay.com. They actually put me on this list of uh, 21 upcoming stars in their 20s something like that um i would actually be putting the link underneath this video so you can check it out and check out that list and what they had to say about me so thank you myessay.com for putting me in that list of 21 rising stars in their 20s that's the actual title so check it out if you have a chance again the link will be right underneath uh, of course underneath this video you will also find my Instagram, my Twitter, my Vine, so you can go ahead and follow me and you can keep in touch with me. Alright guys, so after a long drive to Austin, actually it's only like an hour and a half, so it wasn't that long. But, um, it's time to say goodbye for tonight and to remind you that the world is your studio and that you are the director, so you get to choose how your story ends. Good night, buenas noches, buena noche. Alright guys, well it's a wrap and uh, I just finished recording the last scene in which I come out as Carlos for American Crime and well I mean it's been a total honor and an amazing experience for me to be on this project.